massage, but also scrub my scalp with this. And I just keep doing, this feels so good. Hey friends, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be washing my locks. My hair itches so bad. It feels like I just got my sister locks installed. Y'all know that itch that you get when you first get them installed. That's how bad my hair is itching right now. Y'all get to see the shower. Ignore that. Y'all get to see everything that's in it though. Good thing y'all don't see what's on the shower floor because we need to get another caddy. It looks a hot mess on the shower floor. But yeah, that's a good little view for y'all, I guess, besides me. <laughs> so somebody actually commented on, I think it was my shirt. I think my shirt was too dark for the video. I'm not sure if you know who you are, comment. I think it was my shirt though. I think she couldn't see like my locks really good. It might've also been the lighting. I don't have good light in my apartment, so my videos sometimes look dark depending on what time of day it is. So I made sure I turned on all the lights. I got the ring light on. I also have the window somewhat open. Like you can see somewhat some light. If I have it too open, you can see directly in here. So I don't have it like all the way open. But anyways, so I hope that you can see my locks better now. These are my collarbones right here and my locks go past my collarbone, so I hope this is a really good um, visual of my locks. So you see me in person, if you ever saw me in person, you'll recognize how long my hair is. This is crazy to me, so it's not, my hair is basically not shoulder length anymore. As y'all can see, these are my shoulders. My hair is past my shoulders. Um, I don't remember when the last time my hair was actually past my shoulders so to me this looks really pretty um and it's crazy because they're gonna get so much longer and i'm just so happy for that i'm gonna show you the products that i'm gonna be using one of them they're both new and one of them i really haven't used yet so i'm gonna show you that one first and it is this that is the this is the ren pure plant-based beauty tea tree lemon and sage um, five in one treatment is free of like you know all of the all of the things paraben sulfates all of that stuff I don't know why it's called five in one um I think it like conditions strengthens your hair all of that so that's what it looks like it smells good but I really haven't used this yet I just got it because it was on sale um with this other product i'm about to show you and i've been wanting to try it like every time i'm at whole foods i'm like oh this look nice but i never got it until it was on sale and i got this like a month ago next i'm going to show you this tea tree and rosemary shampoo from the same brand i got it from whole foods this was also on sale this is also plant-based um this smells really good really good um really fresh it don't stay in your hair that long the smell but it do clean your locks really really good um i wish i can somehow have y'all smell this do the excuse me i gotta sneeze <laughs> i wish y'all could smell this through through the camera it smells really good so this is the shampoo that i'm gonna be using and then I also am going to be using this. If you've been watching me for a while, you've probably seen this when I did a haul. And I have two of these. So I just basically take this and like scrub, also like massage my scalp and my, not necessarily my locks, obviously, it's just for your scalp. When I first started to use this, I thought it was going to like damage my locks, but this do not damage your locks at all. It's really good for like scrubbing and massaging your scalp. So that's what I'm going to be doing. And I also use a t-shirt to dry my locks. I don't use the actual towel. Y'all lucky I love y'all because... Um, I look crazy right now, but basically, it look like I'm giving myself a perm. But basically, I'm letting the shampoo kind of penetrate my scalp. And I always take this. Mind you, I'm still not washing my hair in the bathroom. I'm washing it in the kitchen, but I really wanted to show y'all 
how I wash my hair with this tool. So I take the tool and I just kind of massage, but also scrub my scalp with this. And I just keep doing, this feels so good. And y'all, my head do feel so much better. And you really want to get in there because like, I feel like stuff could be hiding in there, like bugs. <laughs> That's just what I be thinking, like. So you really just want to get in there real, real good. Um, I make sure I get behind my ears because my hair is long and you sweat behind your ears. So I make sure I do all of that. Get in the middle. This feels so good. And the tea tree and the rosemary and everything. It's just like cooling to my scalp. So that's basically what I do. Um, make sure you want to get your edges. And this is my second wash, so I'm going to do this one more time. And then I'm gonna come back and show you the end results of my hair. Ah, oh, this feels so good. couple of hours and as y'all can see I have on this um t-shirt that I'm about to take off oh my hair feels so good my scalp feels so good um I had the um, t-shirt on for about 20 minutes and I made sure that I I didn't twist it. I, I would tell you guys not to, tw um, I've seen people like on TikTok and stuff, when they wring their hair out, they literally wring their hair out like a, a shirt or something and they twist it. I don't really think you should do that. So I like gently just squeeze out my locks um, to get all the water out. But y'all, that wash was like like an orgasm for my scalp. <laughs> no lie, like I feel so much better. That feels that felt so good. Oh, hello, tangled up. These this is the results from my wash, you guys. I will show y'all like go through, but it's no point because I don't suffer from dandruff or anything. But all I know is my hair feels so much better. Oh my God, and my face looks so much brighter. <laughs> Let me turn around so you can see how it looks. Oh my God, it's so comfy. This is like the true length of my hair, you might as well say, because it's wet and it didn't shrink up yet. So. I'm curious to see you on camera when I look big at the footage, how it looks. So this is how my hair looks um, from the front, true length. As you can see, it's long. I mean, it was long before, but you can really see my locks and how long they are before my hair starts to shrink up. And this looks so pretty. I wish it would stay like this, but it te technically really stay like this, but it does shrink up just a little bit. Probably like instead of it hanging down here, it'll probably get to like right here when it shrinks up a little. But my hair feels really soft, really clean. It don't smell like Bath and Body Works. And I say that because I don't, um, I don't like really strong shampoos. I like shampoos that smell really clean, really fresh. I don't like to over, I don't want people to really smell my hair when I walk past them. Like smell me, yes, but not my hair. You know what I mean? I just feel like they just be doing too much, um, especially for my locks. So yeah, y'all, I'm so happy. I feel so much better. Um, I think I'm gonna spray a little bit of this on my hair. So let's do that real quick. Um, yeah, this 
this is supposed to detangle and like moisturize your hair. My hair, I don't really care too much for moisture because my hair really don't need moisture. But now since my hair is longer, I do need to like detangle it and stuff. So this is going to help make sure it don't tingle, I guess. We'll see. It's my first time trying it um, on my hair. I think this is water based. It actually looks to me, it just looks like water. Let me see the first ingredient. Yep, the first ingredient is purified water. Simple. That's what I like. Simple for my hair. Real simple. So this is about it um, for my wash day video. I don't know. I wouldn't call it a routine, but this is it for wash day. I hope that you enjoyed this video. I definitely enjoy making it. I feel a lot better. I'm glad I got it done. And as always, leave your comments down below, subscribe, like, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Mwah.